You'll never guess it's a new era in WWE. It's, it's all changed. Vince is shaking things up. Nothing happened. It's a brand new era. Nothing happened different other than the first 30 minutes. Okay, so... Yeah, the first 30 minutes where we had like 30 minutes of Baron Corbin and then the main event of next week's show is in fact Baron Corbin. Like, are you kidding me? Is this for real? That's for real. That that, that would, Baron Corbin's not even the big problem. Baron he's Corbin's, a big problem. Yeah, he, Especially when Seth comes out and he does a promo saying, I heard the fans. I heard everything they said. It's like, and then you're going to main event with Baron Corbin next week? Well, they booed the hell out of Baron Corbin. He actually had a lot of heat, but I don't. But I don't. I don't consider that a positive. Um, the crowd. The crowd tonight was really rabid at the beginning, and it was completely dead at the end. Yeah, because is... they fell for it hook, line, and sinker when Vince and the family went out there, and then they got the same damn show basically. Um, they they talked like a good talk. They, they talked a good game, and they, like, presented the same stuff. There's a real fundamental problem here, and the first segment was really it. It's, it's, it's that the problem here, and this is, like, it, it, it's, it's an inherent thing, whether it's pro wrestling, whether it's boxing, whether it's MMA, whether it's television in general, or, or, or movies or, or um, music or whatever, is this is a star-driven world. And you make your money when you create stars. And with wrestling, whatever whatever it is, it's like it's like I felt like more than ever, you got a whole bunch of worker bees. And worker bees is just like you know, you know, you'll have a an audience and, and they have their audience that's gonna be okay and I I guess there's still enough to break even on on their arena shows and the TV ratings are falling, but they've got they're they're cool for the next five years. Um, you know, there's there's not any problem. There's not going to be any problems there financially. There's no problems and all that, but they're not. But they're losing popularity, and you you never want to have a business that's losing popularity. They're losing popularity, and the way to regain popularity is you make stars. And it's like tonight, just an example. I mean, the the whole show is. The stars are the McMahons, and it's like you make the the thing is you need to keep making new stars. It's like a freaking, you know, it's like it's like if the music industry only had Bruce Springsteen, you, you know, or, or or Hulk Hogan or something like that. And it's like, well, you know, this is it's just like this is actually in many ways this is this is reminiscent of the end of WCW, other than the fact that they're not going to go out of business, in the sense that okay, there's problems, but we're going what are we going to do? More Hulk Hogan. Because Hulk Hogan's a star. But the point is, is that you have to prepare for your future. And, and Shane McMahon and Stephanie McMahon are not the future. Um, God knows Vince isn't. Uh, I don't want to get into Vince tonight, but we, I'm sure we will. But they needed to make stars. And I watched, like, Drew McIntyre, who they want to be a star, was a 50-50 guy tonight. For, for no, you know, he was just a guy on the show. He didn't stand out. Nothing like that. Um, the... Women's whole women's division was like Stephanie dominating, and it was a bunch of worker bees spending an hour boring the people to death, you know, in, in, in some, you know, in, in something that went way too long. Um, they didn't have anything that set up any matches in, in a good way. The next week, we got the Miracle on 34th Street fight, which is fine and good. It is Christmas Eve, and you do those shows and all that, but if it, and, and I guess it worked okay in the arena, but. All I know is the last times, last couple times I've seen these theme gimmick street fight matches, they usually die. And it's like because something used to work, and it's and it's a holiday, we're going to do this theme. But if it hasn't worked in years, isn't that like a clue that maybe the stuff that was cute once everyone's seen and they don't care? Well, about you know, it Dave, if you don't remember what happened last week, it's very unlikely you're going to remember what happened last year. Yeah.